Effects of forces on objects. Force is a vector quantity that has both magnitude and direction. Its unit is the newton, n. When forces act on an object, they can cause the object to change its shape. Direction of moving. Speed. There are many different types of forces, including 1. Weight is the gravitational force due to the gravitational field strength of Earth. Its direction is always downward. 2. Tension is the force in a string, spring, rubber band, or wire when it is stretched or compressed. 3. Normal reaction force is the perpendicular force that act on an object when it is in contact with a surface. 4. Friction is the force that opposes the relative motion of two surface in contact. 5. Air resistance, or drag force, is the resistive force that acts on an object as it moves through air. 6. Liquid resistance, or viscous force, is the resistive force that acts on an object as it moves through a liquid. 7. Upthrust force, or buoyancy force, is the upward force that acts on an object that is partially or fully submerged in a fluid. A car at rest has weight acting downward and normal reaction forces acting upward at its wheels. When a car is moving, there is weight acting downward. Normal reaction forces acting upward at its wheels. Thrust force from the engine acting forward. And air resistance acting backward. When a box is at rest on a rough incline, there is weight acting downward. Normal reaction force acting upward perpendicular to the slope. And friction acting upward parallel to the slope. When we tie the string to a box and pull it, causing the box to move up the incline, there is weight acting downward. Normal reaction force acting upward perpendicular to the slope. Friction acting downward parallel to the slope, because the box is moving up the slope and tension acting up along the slope as shown. When a box floats on the surface of the water, there is weight acting downward, and upthrust acting upward. When a metal sphere is moving downward through the water, there is weight acting downward, upthrust acting upward, and viscosity, or water resistance, acting upward. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, I would be grateful if you would subscribe to my channel, share this video with your friends, and leave a positive comment. Your support will help me to continue making videos and encourage me to create new content. Thank you.